Today we're going to do the install of the Ant E200 on Ubuntu 24.04. It's rather a complicated mess, but here we go. The first thing you need to do is you need to uh, get the lib ssl-dev. So we'll copy that from here and paste it over into here and execute it. All right, so let's grab the uh, libssl dev, and then you need to go out and get a new version of Porth of Python. Of course, the version of Python on 2404 doesn't work, so we go out here to uh, Firefox, and here's the address of the object we want. Copy. Paste, enter, and uh, F Firefox is downloading it to the local file here. Okay, and uh, it's here in downloads and uh, 3.9, so we'll copy 3.9 and go back up over here to uh, Documents Archive. I'm putting everything into our, our Documents Archive just for the heck of it. That's uh, where I put my programs. Okay, paste. All right, and then uh, we'll go over here into LS and we'll un untar it. Copy, paste, okay, and then we'll go into the uh, directory, copy, paste, and then we'll do a configure. The important thing is you got to have enable share on here. And then we'll do a uh, a make. Okay, make J12. And then after the make, we need to do a make install. Paste. And so we've now installed the version of Python that uh, Ant E200 likes. And, uh, okay, so we always need to do this LDF config paste. And then we need to use pip3 to pull in the the items that uh, are needed to do the build so you need this yml file and then you need numpy copy paste numpy and then requests Copy, paste, request, and then Mako. Mako is the last one we need. Copy, paste, request. Okay. And then there's a few more libraries we need to install. We need to install libusb uh, 1.0 div. So we'll go ahead and do that again. Copy, paste. All right, so it's already been installed, so that happens really quickly. And then this one, uh, Boost. You need an old version of Boost, and you need an old version of uh, Python. 
in order for this to work. Hopefully one of these days they'll upgrade it. And then now um, we need to get the RF space. This includes the uh, Ant UHD library and uh, all right so we'll stop here and pick it up when it's down it takes a while to download this so we might as well uh, stop the recording and pick it up later okay the download is <coughs> done and so we can go into the uh, RF space and then into this uh, Ant SDR ULD Master 3. This is my version of the uh, Ant library because the Ant library has several errors in it and and uh, I fixed the errors in this version and so you can grab the old version and diff it with my version to find the changes that need to be made to actually have it work uh, and uh, okay we in host yeah we're in host so we do create a build library And uh, execute this long CMake command. Do -de do -de do -de do. <laughs> Come on, oh, you. Copy, paste. Okay, so this does the setup for building the uh, Ant library. And the th main thing is is that in the enabled components that uh, Ant shows up. So Ant shows up here. That's all you need really for sure. And so now we can do a... Uh, a make. Yeah, make it 24. What the heck? So this is building the uh, ant library, and like I said, it's got seven or eight changes that I had to make to actually compile it. It would really be nice if they'd fix those errors. All right, and then now we can do the uh, make install. And then uh, this uh, load config so other things can find it. And then we'll clone the soapy UT. UHD library. Okay, going to Soapy UHD. And then uh, make a build directory. CD build. All right. See make. And then uh, do an install on it. Oh, see make make 
minus j eight. And then I issue the U make install and then the uh, load config again. And so that's the build and we'll Test it here. IQ SD S D R R dot X and radio and uh, twenty thousand hertz. Okay, so there you have it. The uh, the build of the Ant E200 on Ubuntu 24.04. And uh, in case you're wondering, no, Cubic SDR does not work, and GQRX do not work on on Ubuntu 22.04.